Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to Disney Trivia and I went last week, no, two weeks ago and we came in like third. So we're gonna try to get first tonight. Um, I'm going with Hannah and Alyssa and so we shall see how this goes. I was gonna record at the last one too and then it just like felt really tight at our table and I wasn't comfortable so tonight I'm thinking that I might record on my phone because I do wanna make a vlog of it because I think trivia is very fun. So yeah, let's go to Disney trivia. Okay, so we showed up late, so we missed the first like <laughs> question. The first question was, what's Walt's favorite character? And then the other one was, what's he gonna be, what was he gonna be if he wasn't an animator? And then the next one was, what is his favorite princess out of the seven that he was alive for? So we guessed Mickey, a farmer, and Snow White. Probably wrong, but we need to find our drinks and then order them and then get this party started. It's very embarrassing walking in here late. Like a famous anime. Was it Was it Was it Roy? I don't know. Was Roy an animator? I know yeah. he was like in charge of like the yeah, so so. Oh my god, wow. I'm so confident coming into this. This is so much harder than I thought. Ugh. I don't know. I feel like it's definitely not Roy, but like I, there's no name that's coming to mind, so. Also, our team name is Main Street Swifties. We were gonna be Main Street Taylor's version, but like, <laughs> not that much, not that much uh, room on this paper. So, yeah. Guys, what's Walt's wife's what name? Was the name of Walt Disney's Yeah, we can take the the Main Street song. I think it's Lillian. Really? Yeah. yeah. Is it Lillian? Yes. Okay. Yes. You look so cutie. Thanks. The green matches perfectly. Hey Alyssa. She's ordering our drinks and our food. Hi vlog. Um, here at trivia night. We relate, so that was really embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we got a sweet flight. Here's Alyssa. She didn't get introduced yet today. This quality is horrible. I feel like I'm like filming back in like 2013. What is happening? This one is the painted rose 2021. Do you like it? Oh yeah, I like it. Oh good. It's a little drier than I thought it was Okay. You tried it? Yeah, I did. Wait, get the dog, get the dog. I did, he's so cute, he's just walking around. Didn't like the first one. How do I get to the second one? No. Okay, what's this one? Another rosé. Oh, stuff. This is better than the first one. There's just like not a lot of flavor. It's a lot of like, very thick alcohol taste. That oh, one is better. Like, you don't like that? It's better than the first one. And then what's this one? What's Traminette? Is that how you say it? I have little heard it. I've never heard of it. Me neither. Ooh, maybe I'll get Shrimp Tempura. That's better. And then the last one's Charger. Hey. I usually don't go for that. Yeah, no. I'm not like getting any of these besides this one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What's yeah, the Traminette? I yeah. like uh, like blueberry, peach, little fruit scotters and stuff like that. Our cheese board came out. She looks fit. That looks good. Definitely not like gonna be filling enough, but they have like a food truck here too. What is the only hotel? No, I don't know. On Walt Disney World property that has a floor? I think it's an No, no, no. Contempt, I feel like specifically skips. I can't remember. The contemporary. Also what was the first guess? Riviera. Oh. I think, I think it's in fact the Tower of Terror. Or oh. Better than oh. switched over to the camera because the phone just wasn't working and I don't really care anymore. So, um, he did read out the first round of answers and I think we got two right. What was the first answer? Oh, it was Pluto. And then Pluto was his favorite. What was his job going to be? He was going to be, I don't even remember what he said, a vacuum cleaner salesman, we guessed farmer. Oh, and then his favorite princess is Cindy, which we guessed Snow. And then who was the first animator was of? of iWorks, I knew that, but we got the year right, 1928, so we got two points, well one point for that, and then his wife is Lillian, so we got that right, and then hopefully we start doing better now, because we got in late, so I think we were frazzled, so we're good now. And we are moving on. 
on to the now task. That is right. We are going to be looking at the cast and characters now of the world. We got this wrong. Thanks. The same. So, question one from round two. The Bane Mouth himself, Mickey Mouth, when is his birthday? <laughs> I went to do not need the year, but it would be greatly appreciated. Did I make a post on this day? When is Mickey Mouth's birthday? I thought it was going to be The month and the day. Also, we have that YouTube button. Yeah, I said uh, I to remember I did. I made a post. Remember, it was the wrong date? Yes. I think it's November 18th, is it? I'm just yeah. going to say that. November 18th, 1928. Well, you said you don't need the year, but I guess I'll put it on. You said extra points if you have it. Oh. What is Goofy's original name? Before he was known as Goofy, what was his original name? What was his original name known as? In the year 1947, what university did Donald Duck become the mascot for? In the year 1947, Donald Duck became the mascot for what university? Morgan? Are you guessing? For the ducks. Oh, yeah? Okay, that's a good guess. Look at the puppy. Hi, puppy. Hello. Are you so cute? Okay, bye. Who originally owned Pluto as a pet? Oh. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Who was Pluto? Oh, it's Mickey. Not me getting all pressed. I'm like, this part of the. Who owns Mickey? Yeah, but was it Mickey? Well, now it's like Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Wait, is it is it Pluto Mickey's dog? Yeah, it's Pluto Mickey's dog. That's the question. No, it said who was originally. The owner of Pluto. Oh, really? So Pluto is Mickey's dog. So he's not anymore. We're just saying, we're saying, it's Mickey. <laughs> Which character flies above the Magic Kingdom every single night? Which character flies above the Magic Kingdom every single night? I think the first one's right. Yeah. I feel like you're wondering three. Is right. Yeah. 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 I think, I think Mickey is right, too. I think number four is right. We are going to do our enter round challenge. What is like the, the only Disney movie to future square trees? What was the only Disney movie that future square trees? My guess would be Wreck It Ralph. Just because like, it's a game. Yeah. It is not the Lord, so it's not the trees, not oh, square. Like I thought you guess, go ahead. The is so close, but incorrect. What's the only movie that features square Mary trees? Mary Poppins had an umbrella, and probably the trees, but it's not square. Solution? Me? Yeah. Alice Wonderland. Ralph is Disney, but incorrect. Oh, okay, I'm good. Because I'd have been mad if it was right, and I didn't go. Fantasia 2000 is also really correct. We didn't give up on this one. Oh, wait, we have. That's not the problem. The correct answer would, in fact, be a turbo song finding the one up here. You got this. You got this. What do you think it is? Just shout it out. Up is not correct. I also thought that. Uh, it could be up. We can take it up. 
Oh, the correct answer was Sleeping Beauty, guys. Sleeping Beauty? What is the name of Edgar Rowell's boot from Hotback Notre Dame? What is the name of Edgar Rowell's boot? I just watched it on Notre Dame, but I don't remember. It is the name of Edgar Rowell's boot. It is Jolly! You are absolutely correct. Jolly? Jolly? How many Brits are in Cinderella's castle? Get it, get it. Yeah, it's literally nothing. We're so Let me try to show you how far away they are. Literally, the speaker's like all the way over there. Anyways, the speaker's all the way over there. We are in the farthest corner. <laughs> it's crazy. Here's Honey. Hi, cutie. Out of all of these flags that are that line Main Street, USA, in the Magic Kingdom, how many of those flags are real? How many of them are real US flags? Um, um, I'm going to explain that now. What? What is the correct answer? You did not wear three times in the blue. It's the one that's on the black hole. All of these flags are missing a tab. Shout out to the black hole. Oh, was it bronze? Oh, it was bronze. Thanks, bronze. Wait, that's weird. Why is it? The yeah. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> Answer for a question. When is Mickey Mouse's birthday? It is November 18th. You are correct. Yes, What was Goofy originally known as? Dippy Dog. Dippy Dog was the correct answer. And that was D I P P Y. That's how I feel. What university did Donald Duck become a mascot for in 1947? Oregon. Oregon. Yeah. They were the Oregon Fighting Ducks. I knew it. Um, and when you were the Sprite, you walked in. My obsession with the Pokemon. How did you know the Oregon's mascot? Oregon Ducks? Yeah. Who originally owned Pluto as a pet? Mickey Mouse. Thank you, ma'am. Wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. Before you did, it was Minnie Mouse. Oh, I'm just going to be like, oh, they're going to get it right. It was wrong. It's Minnie Mouse. I feel like these guys are not true. Who was the most black king of every single night? Tinkerbell. She comes out right after she has the all the car supply. Who was her name right now? Who was her name right now? Who was her name right now? Oh, we're inside. And you're round number three. Oh my god. Round number three is going to do with the place that you're going to be you on the spark. This is so good. It's probably kind of even in town. Can I shrimp these? So many questions about the barn. I sure be. I don't like seafood, so. Can I show you? Yeah, they are so good. Oh, shit. Sure. Here, I can move this. Are you guys ready? Krabby Tots. Yeah. <laughs> Question number one for round number three. I can't believe I'm second. That's I know. Crazy. What ride is at every park? What ride no. is featured at every single park? Okay, we're big thunder. I don't think that's in there. Like, it's it's small, but I can't remember. You know, I'm just going to base on the vlogs I've seen or overseen, and we're just going to go with. Right now, I'm like really in game mode. Like, I want to win. Because at first, I was like, oh, we're doing so bad. Like, it's not even like worth it. But now we're like on the board. Also, I do mayo chop with my tops. This is a lot of freaking sauce. With the sauce. So, so, I know, but there's also a lot of freaking tachos. And question number two. Everyone knows Walt Disney World has a secret tunnel system. What they do down there is still a mystery. But 
But what is the name of the secret tunnel system underneath Disney World's Magic Kingdom? What is the name of the secret tunnel system? Shout out to my last trip to the answer. Because I still want to move. Question number three. What sweet item is I think? Is it sold at any Disney park? What sweet item is not sold it could be at any Disney park? Oh, uh, magic enough. Oh, 
Eric Cotterman, can you visit at Epcot Disney World? If you make it through the entire day drinking and do not stumble over, you would hit 11 countries. <laughs> and our last question. How much was the mission for Disney World on opening day 1971? It was $3.50 for an adult. I cannot believe I got that right. But like, I literally don't have proof of that. It just like, it literally just came to me. I must have seen it somewhere. Yes. Like subconsciously, I knew it. <laughs> Third. I want to argue. And Phoenix first place, 11 points. It's also right. He's like, man, it's free We're going to go right over. Section 4 is going to be all about the things in the movie. All about the movie. Train about his name. Question number one. In Finally Nemo. Dory, and I'm blanking on the name. Marlon. Marlon. Marlon, thank you. Marlin. Marlin and Dory go on a brave journey to find Nemo. During this search, they stumble on a radical sea turtle named Crush. How old is Crush? How old is Crush? Guess this one in the car. We practiced, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Just basically just remove the iron at this point. I've just been eating these tops the whole night. And question number two. How old is the wife? How old is the wife? 14? Yeah. Question number three. In Beauty and the Beast. How perfect. What is the name of Belle's father? In Beauty and the Beast, what is the name okay. in Bandito? Uh -oh. There is the Sorcerer. What does his name yes. spell if you're to spell backwards? What does the Sorcerer's name spell backwards? Again. And I only know this because we studied in the car. <laughs> what were the names of the ugly Stepsisters in Cinderella. What were the other one of the stepsisters? What were the name of the stepsisters in Cinderella? I think I made it the copy because we got all of them right. What senior band actually broke up in Disney World? What famous band broke up? You, you, you are scaring me. Yes, my intensity is so clear. Wait, don't make me do that right yet. You deserve this. Look at this list of people. Who has the least lines spoken of any of the major Disney characters? Who has the least lines spoken? Sleeping Beauty is incorrect. Pluto is incorrect. Dumbo is correct. With an absolute light count. He is a he is quickly followed behind by Aurora, who has exactly 18 lines of dialogue. 18 or more? I know you, 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 I know <laughs> I'm like, what is she dancing? <laughs> I don't know. How old is Trust in Finding Nemo? 150 years and still young. Play. Play. How old is Snow White? Play, Mama. What? Hers is 14. She is Hers. not old enough to be kissed. I think that's how it is. She's yes. Nobody's old enough. 
aged at 14. What is the name of Bell's father in Beauty and the Beast?
I'm not a pro thief at this table. You had the correct answer, but you didn't come to the table. Technically, you got your first. It is Nixon, one of the scariest movies of my generation. The Ray was had the evil character, Samara, who came out of the TV. This was played by Miss Chase. But who did Miss Chase also voice actress for in the Disney movies? Not a clue, but that's kind of interesting. What came out when the ring was? Okay, there was a mumble of the crowd. They couldn't figure out the answer. It was Island. The correct answer was Lilo. Hmm. Lilo and Sid. Really? I know. Learned wow. That's crazy. That's like the best thing we learned today. The most interesting fact I would say. What is the most sold souvenir item at Disney World? Disney. At Disney. In a collective. Is it? You might know it. But you got to come from here. It is ear. Mickey Mouse was originally going to be named Mortimer. I know, horrible. Who would have ever wanted that? Luckily, it wasn't, and the name was changed to Mickey because of who? As a race, they're both very slowly racing. Lily. Is the correct answer. So we're going to go over the songs really fast. Our first song was. Should we just go? Up? It's going to be great. From the Winnie. It's going to be great. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. The second song was Trash in the Camp. From Tarzan. Her, her, her. First bite, first bite. What made the red man red, which did not hold up? Yeah. And, and <laughs> I realized that as soon as I played it. Mm. And I'm sorry. What is from Peter Pan? Let's fucking go. <laughs> Fixer Upper. Good job, honey. Fixer Upper was actually from Frozen. Our fifth song was One Little Slip from The Chicken Little. One Little What? One Little Whatever. Number six was Gone yeah, we did. From the Outcast from The Hunchback of Dover Dog. Uh, what we got from Dover Dog? We got the yeah. Number seven was On My Way from Brother Bear. And number eight was the Siamese cat song from Lady okay. and the Tramp. <laughs> number nine was Yodel Adol 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 Once again, Yodel Adol 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 from Home on the Range. In the Range? Oh my god. And of course, the last song of the night was. By Merida. Not by Merida. So I am back home now. Trivia was fun. I think we came in third. I don't really know. Um, but that's just what I'm going to say because that's pretty much the place we were in all night. So yeah, uh, I don't think we did any better this time than we did last time, but I like to learn new stuff. So that was fun. I think the fact about like Samara, whatever her name is, from The Ring voicing Lilo was like the most interesting fact that I learned tonight. But yeah. Um, I'm sorry if this vlog was boring because it might have been, but I like to just like bring you guys along for like little local Disney things that I do. Usually I do that kind of stuff on Instagram, but I want to like step out of my comfort zone a little bit and do a vlog of the Disney trivia tonight. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure that you give it a thumbs up and subscribe and that you tap the bell icon so you're notified every time I post, which is every Friday, and I will see you guys real soon. Bye!